How's everybody doing out there in YouTube land? Me and my main man, Roman Barnes, here out in the wilds of San Bernardino. Look at him. Loyal. German Shepherds, if you ain't got one, get one. You want loyalty in your life. But anyway, so I'm walking out here and I'm thinking, what? What am I gonna talk about today? And it, it dawned on me. I uh I wanted to buy myself one of those policeman batons. They're retractable. They're, they're only about mm, maybe a foot. Not even quite a foot. Well, got online to order one. They're like 30 bucks, 28 bucks, something like that. Uh, they're retractable. And uh, so I tried to order it. Whoever's selling them, they're from Georgia. So I go to complete the order and it says, cannot ship to California. And I'm like, you gotta be kidding me. And uh, so I'm like, well, how am I gonna get around this? So what I did was, is I had it shipped to someone that I knew could help me with this. I won't say who, uh, but I had it shipped to Omaha, where you can ship it. And it, for those of you that don't know, this is what it is. This is what it looks like. And all you do is if there's any kind of trouble, bam. And trust me, you do not want to get hit by this. This thing will, it'll send you back a few steps. I promise. Anyway, so I had a ship to Omaha and then I, uh, I paid to ship it from Omaha to California. So now I have two of them. They're illegal and you know, you can own guns here. I'm not a gun owner. I had a couple of bad experiences with guns when I was a kid, so I just choose not to own one. I certainly do support the Second Amendment uh, for those that are probably a little more responsible than I am. Uh, and I would stand behind them 100% on that. It's just me personally, I have no business owning a gun, I don't feel like. We got Roman here, he's a puppy. We live in San Bernardino, and someday he'll be formidable, but right now he is not. And I got pretty pretty used to feeling secure with Cash around. Cash was a dog you didn't want to mess with. If he was mad or if he thought you were threatening one of his family, he could get pretty grisly, uh, which I always appreciated and trusted. And after he passed, I felt very, very vulnerable that he wasn't, uh, he wasn't around anymore. So that was one of the reasons that I that I uh, bought a German Shepherd so soon after his passing. We live in San Bernardino and eh, you know I mean our neighborhood is nice but you step outside of that little cul-de-sac or neighborhood pocket there and it gets ugly quick. There's a ton of homeless that live all around us and uh, a lot of them have mental problems and, and, and you know, trust me, I, my heart goes out to them, but you know, they can become dangerous. Uh, there's been several uh, instances where a homeless man goes into a restaurant, family was eating there, a guy had his little four-year-old daughter sitting on, sitting on his lap. A homeless guy walks into the restaurant, just stabs him in the neck, kills him, dead. Not to mention the, the criminals, just the regular of, sound mind criminals that are running around out there uh, with the tattoos on their faces and stuff like that that's a real thing here so my point is that uh it's always dark before i can take young whippersnapper there uh for a walk so feeling vulnerable i thought i gotta have some form of protection and i learned about those batons so i wanted to have one or two to be able to protect myself uh, in the house and out in the walk, on walks at night. So when I wanted to buy it and found out I couldn't buy it here in California, I thought, <laughs> well, that figures, California. That's where uh, uh, common sense goes to die. So I got me two batons and I, uh, I highly recommend getting one, especially if you're not a gun owner. Uh, they're retractable and it becomes a, a formidable stick against uh, against bad actors and it's it's cold here it's about 50 it was, i think it was like 54 or 56 degrees when we took off so it's cold so i'm not worried about rattlesnakes 
Uh, Cash somehow knew how to dodge him, and maybe he will too, but uh, I, I wouldn't let him do this, not yet anyway, uh, if it was really hot, because they come out when it's hot. Maybe there's a poopy in them. Come on. You don't want to get the parvo, pal. So I'll uh, go ahead and sign off now, and I hope you all have a, a happy Saturday. Peace out.